when I was looking for co-ops and internship, everyone wants someone who's experienced and talented and knows a lot of stuff. I feel as an engineer, no matter how much I learn in school, I'm not going to get that experience unless someone actually has that faith in me. Hi, Sam. How you doing? Pretty good. You? Sam is mainly interested in computers. I tried to encourage him to look at all aspects of electrical engineering. So these are the equipment I spent most of my first work time working with. I panic sometimes and I think, oh, maybe I should call Mark. But I just felt it was more fun if I figured it out myself. The co-op program is different from internship because the students work at the same company for three to four work terms. And so they return and usually get increasingly bigger responsibility and projects. Whatever you do, you have to get work experience before you graduate. That is the name of the game these days. And so these are the biomedical engineering companies that we work for in the college. The yellow flags are where I currently place students. Our co-ops, they come back changed. They come back and they don't even realize that they're speaking in acronyms that their team or their company used. And working here and working with Mark has allowed me to focus more on certain things that I need to develop as a student. Hey, you graduate, you come out of school, and you have that one step ahead of everyone else who doesn't do the co-op program. Every company is going to see you as someone who's actually done engineering work. You can't take any classes that teach you what engineers should be doing in the real world. That's what being out here, getting the experience itself, is going to do for you.